where's my order when will i get my order you don't know how to run a business properly so i'm like okay girl like what's your order number child tell me why it was order like 34,962. I ain't had no 34,962 orders. So how can you have that order number if I've never had that many orders? Like, make it make sense. another keeping up with cat vlog so this one is an entrepreneur themed vlog small business well let me not say small big business vlog okay period i don't have any orders today to fulfill or anything like that because my website is currently sold out which is such an amazing feeling so if you were someone who shopped i appreciate you so so much and i will have a restock I'm hoping closer to the end of this month. I think one of the like top questions that I get is where did I find my lashes? How do I source my products? How do I find suppliers and vendors? Well, today I'm finally answering your question. So I want to tell you all about madeinchina.com and this portion of today's video is sponsored by them. Madeinchina.com is a free online marketplace made to connect entrepreneurs with Chinese suppliers. The benefit of sourcing your items from overseas is that you're able to get large quantities for low cost. So that way you're able to generate the most profit from your sales and madeinchina.com gives you access to thousands of overseas suppliers and their products simply by downloading their app. So I'm pulling up the app on my phone right now to show you how convenient and user friendly it is. It makes trading so fast and so easy. So there are over 40 million products from over 27 industries to choose from, including beauty products. So if you're interested in starting a lash business similar to mine, definitely, definitely, definitely check out madeinchina.com. Just to give you all a quick example, when I type in lashes in the search bar, it pops up with over 38 thousand options and each listing has a detailed description of the products along with a contact supplier button that way you can directly connect with the supplier ask some questions about the products discuss payment options shipping terms this app basically allows you to conduct business from anywhere in the world at any time from the comfort of your car your bed while you're at your other job your nine to five like this app allows you to to do it all wherever you're at to start sourcing products for your business, simply scan the QR code on the screen. This will allow you to quickly download the app. Then you'll have access to thousands of suppliers and your products so that you can start making your business dreams become your reality. They also have tons of free coupons as well, so make sure you all take advantage of those deals. I'm going to go ahead and actually insert some footage from my end of summer sale to show you all the sale that actually sold out my site a few weeks ago. And uh, I hope you all enjoy it. So. Keep on watching. Okay. Whew. It's still like smoking hot. Can y'all see that? So I actually just got a shopify notification on my phone someone just sent me a message on my website's little chat box i'm actually thinking about disabling the chat box because some people are being like really annoying and like taking advantage of it maybe like a week or two ago someone started harassing me through it and was like where's my order when will i get my order you don't know how to run a business properly like insulting me like screaming at me via text obviously so i'm like okay girl like what's your order number child tell me why it was order like 34,962. I ain't had no 34,962 orders. So how can you have that order number if I've never had that many orders? Like, make it make sense. I'm gonna go ahead and finish up this cup of coffee and I will see y'all when um, when I go out and like run my errands or whatever. Good question. I mean, well, not really a question, just a statement. It's not illegal to to park in the curbside if you're not here for curbside, is it? <laughs> I guess I'm gonna run in here real quick. 
all I need to get is like some tape. If I see anything else cute, I'm gonna grab it. But I just need some tape to tape up like um, a box because one of my customers made like a really, really big order. I'm gonna tell y'all about it when I get back to the house. But it won't be able to fit in my like regular pink bubble mailers. So I do have boxes for that reason, but I ran out of tape. So I'm gonna get some tape and then right back to the house. Hey girl, I'm back at the house, clearly. I just had to run downstairs and reboot my Wi-Fi router. It's only 8.30, so still pretty early. Really happy about that. I'll be done processing orders by nine o'clock easily, and I can go ahead and get this stuff shipped out to y'all so y'all can have it if you're close by tomorrow, and if you're a little bit further by Monday at the latest. Oh, there it goes, it just, it just refreshed. Yay, that's exciting. So I just like got a glimpse of like somebody who ordered for me and the girl who did my hair ordered for me. Thank you so much, Kristen. Oh, that means so much to me. That's my, that's my girl. Like that's my girl. I'm be hanging out with her. Anyway, so I, uh, from Walgreens, I just ended up getting just the one roll of shipping tape. I feel like it would be smarter to just order something like this in bulk, but let me tell y'all why I am actually like okay with not ordering it in bulk. Here's the thing with starting a business. You need to be reasonable when you are getting your inventory, getting your supplies, all that. Cause the last thing you want is to go broke buying lashes or lip gloss or t-shirts and then you can't sell the product and you're just sitting on this inventory that you can't do anything with. I got a lot of questions about that in my like launch day vlog. A lot of you all wanted to know like how many lashes did I get? And I'm not gonna share that information because I do not want to mislead anybody. But for those of you all that ask that question or who are trying to just do whatever I did, you can't do that because I started my business with the hope that my supporters and my following from social media would help to kind of give me some traction. I know I also got the question like, did most of my orders come from my friends and family? Like, no, like I can literally count on two hands which of my friends and family ordered, maybe even one hand. But I didn't go into it expecting them to support me, which is another thing I feel like people do. Like people start businesses and then they think they're gonna get all these sales. They start, they get one sale and they're confused. And then they wanna go and bash their friends and family. Like they don't support me, they're not supporting me. But you shouldn't want your business to be successful based off of your family support. Like I get it, you want the people closest to you to support you, but they're not obligated to. And so I just want y'all to be realistic when starting your businesses and know that, hey, I may not get a whole lot of sales the first day or the first week or even the first month. That's why marketing is so important. And especially a day like today where we have social media and access to people all over the world, you have to use that to your advantage. The, the orders are just not gonna come from nowhere. Even with me having over 400,000 followers on my, my platform, do y'all think I got 400,000 orders or sell 400,000 pairs of lashes? Hell no. So be realistic, start small and scale up. To me, it is better to start small and sell out or run out of product than to buy all this stuff and then you can't get it sold. So even with something like this shipping or packaging tape, I could have easily gone on Amazon and bought maybe 10 to 20 rolls of this in bulk, but I just simply don't need it right now. Most of my orders get shipped in bubble mailers, but I do have one customer who ordered, she ordered 15 pairs of lashes and they won't fit in my small mailers. Y'all, Cynthia has placed at least, I think six orders with me. She may have placed more, but I know six for sure off the top of my head. And she is the person who just ordered 15 pairs from my sale. But even before that, y'all, this woman had already ordered like over 50 pairs of lashes from me. So plus this additional 15, like to me, I, I'm just like shook, I'm mind blown. Cause she just literally, literally with this previous order for 15 items, she literally just paid my like utility bill. <laughs> So it means the world to me. Like, thank you so much, girl. Like, it means everything.
at a stopping point of boxing up the very last order and doing the TikTok that I wanted to stop and like show y'all on camera. So I wrote my supporter a little note thanking her first and foremost for her like sixth or seventh order, but also letting her know that I threw in some goodies. So she will be the first person to try out one of my new products which may or may not be a last adhesive pen and then also this a little kit that comes with a pair of tweezers a pair of lash applicators and then a pair of scissors to basically make a ass lash application as smooth as possible and then here is a peek inside we have the pink tissue paper but there's the 10 pair of Anastasia and Anastasia lashes on this side, the five pair of Jacqueline on that side, the lash adhesive pen, and then I don't know if y'all can like, see, and then the little tool kit too. So I'm getting ready to pretty much just finish up the TikTok of me packaging up this order and then I'm going to go drop everything at the post office. While my phone is charging, because I just realized I'm on one percent, I'm like, oh my gosh, like, of course, my phone is about to die and I need to TikTok. So I'm letting my phone charge. So I'm just sitting here for a minute. And I wanted to show y'all this bag that I was sent kind of like as like PR. So there is a girl here on YouTube. I believe her name is Kanisha. I've actually watched some of her entrepreneur videos, like before I started my own series. So she came out with these bags that say I started the businesses and she sent me one and it's so, so cute. So typically when I have orders, I'll put them like if I have a whole lot of orders, I'll just put them in a big old cardboard box. But on a day like today where I only have like 15 orders, they fit so beautifully. She also has them available in other like colors and stuff like that. So definitely Go check her out. I will have her information down below. But yeah, super, super cute. Like so, so cute. I absolutely am obsessed with that. Okay, so basically I was just like counting my orders um, to make sure that I had everything. There's a post office literally like 30 seconds from my house typically i only go there if i just have like stuff that can fit in the mailbox which is typically all of my mailers are able to fit but since i have this big box i'm gonna go ahead and drive like 15 minutes away to this other post office that's like a bit bigger uh just so they can like process this box for me but it's okay because like after this i don't have anything to do i'm gonna be like chilling for the rest of the day and just like going through some new inventory and stuff like that Alright you all, so that is pretty much the end of this big business period entrepreneur vlog. I hope you all enjoyed it. Of course, if you want more videos like this, be sure to let me know down below so I can keep bringing them your way. Thank you all so, so much for watching, for supporting my business, for supporting me. All of that, I love you all so much and I will see you in my next video.